the Newcastle legend has scored more Premier League goals than any other player in the competition, with a mammoth 260 to his name. A top-flight title with Blackburn in 1995 and an international strike rate of 30 goals in 63 caps substantiates the 48-year-old's standing as one of the finest England strikers of all time. Since retiring 13 years ago, the Geordie has gone on to become one of the most recognizable faces on television too, with his punditry exploits. Shearer is a regular fixture on Match of the Day as well as the BBC's live coverage of the FA Cup and international tournaments. But for all the goals at the Gallagate and all the money earned and glory of lifting the Premier League trophy, the former striker takes most gratitude in something away from football. Alongside a large body of charity work, the iconic number nine set up the Alan Shearer Foundation in 2012. In a personal message from the founder, the website reads, My foundation was set up to directly support the Alan Shearer Center in Newcastle. It is a highly specialist, disability, respite, residential and social provision for people with complex disabilities and acute sensory impairments. That foundation has turned over £2.93 million as of March last year, and Sharer raised a further £200,000 on Saturday night at a charity ball in association with the North East Football Writers Association. What an amazing night at the Ad Alan Sheriffen Ball, Shearer wrote on Twitter. So many people to thank for helping to raise over pounds 200k. Newcastle's most cherished player also received the Personality of the Year award, and the FWA website honored his work. Shearer has raised over 11 million pounds for charities since retiring, it reads. He said he gets more satisfaction from his charity work than any of his many achievements on the pitch. The Sir Bobby Robson Foundation, for whom Shearer is a patron, was also represented at the event, 